Hey guys, so we're going to continue on with our little app here that you can see just has the button and the view change. And what we're going to do is we're going to add background image to these two views just to give it a little personalized touch. So we're going to start out by actually getting and importing our images that we've created to make the background of these two views. So I'm going to go over to my application folder and we're going to add files to our application. Now I like to keep things neat so I actually made a folder called underscore images that has the background image that I want in there. And usually I'll make one images folder and then keep importing from this one folder any image and that I want to be putting into my application just to keep it a little bit cleaner. Uh, I also have subfolders in there usually, but we're just going to actually click on this folder and add the entire thing. Now it should have added this one background image that we're going to use. And how we apply it is we go to our main storyboard. We're going to click on our first view controller, or we'll call it the main menu. We're going to come down to our objects and add an image view. And we're going to stretch this over the entire view since it's going to be the background. We're going to come up to our image view here and we're going to call it background. Now you can see that it actually added the image view on top of everything else and that's not what we want. So what we want to do is take the background and drag it all the way up to the top underneath the view. You can see everything else comes ahead of that and it's on top of the background. Okay. So now we're going to click on the background itself and head over to the properties. And you can see that the image here, and it already gives us the three default images that come in with Xcode, but we're actually going to use our background image. Okay. We're going to save that off. We're also going to do the same thing to our second view controller. So we're going to add an image view. Stretch it out over the entire view. Let's rename it. Let's move it behind everything else. And let's just come up to the image itself and change the background. Okay. Now when we save that off and run it, we should have the background. Okay. 